Optical Systems Design, or OSD Optics, is an optical software and engineering company. We are located in Tucson, Arizona, and we are the official provider of Synopsys Lens Design Software. Synopsys stands for Synthesis of Optical Systems. It was first launched by Don Dilworth about 50 years ago. The Synopsys Lens Design Software developed by Don Dilworth has the fastest optimization algorithm in the industry and offers a set of innovative and powerful automatic design tools. The Synopsys optimization is very different from the other optical design softwares. It runs on the powerful pseudo-secondary derivative algorithm. By considering the higher order terms, the PSD method can converge faster into a deeper minima. Let's look at the system. It has seven flat glass plates, not much of an optical system to speak of. However, if you put it in Synopsys and run the optimization, In less than one second, Synopsys turns it into a seven element imaging system with an average RMS of six microns over three fields. This is the power of Synopsys optimization. The automatic design tool in Synopsys is created to help optical designers find realistic starting points quickly, as well as to explore the design space and discover new design forms that may not be realized by human designers using conventional design protocols. Sometimes the design forms returned by the numerical algorithm may even have better performance. In this video, I will show you the binary design search method and the saddle point method, both of which are included in our innovative and powerful automatic design tools. The first category of the automatic design tools is based on the binary search algorithm. Just say that you're gonna to start to design a system with five elements with an F number of 3.5 and a back focal length of 33. How long will it take? In the conventional method, you may start with a first order design using ideal lenses, replace the ideal lenses with thick lenses, then start to optimize your system, and so on and so forth. Or you will try to do a literature search to find how other people do it for a similar system. You then use it as your design starting point to optimize it into your own design. With Synopsys, you don't need to do any of that. You will let the computer do the work for you. All you need to do is prepare this D-Search macro. Stating your design goals, five elements, F number of 3.5, back focal length of 33, then run it in synopsis. The binary search algorithm will start searching through all possible combinations of these five elements while performing optimization at the same time and return to you the 10 best candidates for your five element system design starting point. This takes less than 10 seconds. Now imagine the time you can save by using the automatic design tool in Synopsys if you are designing a more complex system, such as a 20 plus element lithography system. The second category of the automatic design tools is based on the saddle point method. You can use this method to build a complete system without a starting point. You can also use this method to scan an existing design to find out where you can insert one or more elements to improve system performance or to find out where you can delete an element without impacting the system performance so that you can decrease the cost of manufacturing your system. A saddle is a shape that curves up in one direction and down in another direction. A lot of times during optical design and the available degrees of freedom in your design, the optimization process may be going along this line and settle at this point, a local minimum, and you think that is the design. However, what if you can go down this green line and get to this lower minimum and thus get a better design? But how can you go from this red line to this green line? One method is to add degrees of freedom for your design. By adding this thin shell to this element, it increases the degree of freedom to the design and thus allows the optimization to go in a different direction that may lead to a lower minimum. This is the concept behind the saddle point algorithm in Synopsys. Now let's see how it works. Here is a simple script to build a five element system using the saddle point method. Let's run it. You see that Synopsys is adding lenses to the system, one lens at a time, one, two, three, four, five. And at the same time, it is changing the lens parameters to optimize the system until it is built completely. If you are doing it manually, it would be very tedious to go through all these configurations or trial and error, especially if you are designing a complex system, for example, a lithography system with more than 20 elements. 
However, with the help of Synopsys, it becomes quite easy. This is a brief introduction to the Synopsys Lens Design software. It is a fast, powerful program developed by an expert in optical design, Don Dilworth. It infuses his optics knowledge with fast numerical algorithms and rides on the computational power offered by modern technology.